Well, it's that time of year again. There is dirt to be plowed. So we're out here today, Claremont, Minnesota. Just watching quite a few machines go around. I'm just a spectator today. I didn't bring anything. So we'll uh, take some video. Let you guys enjoy as well. The distance there we got a John Deere two-cylinder too far away to make out what it is a little closer here at a newer series IH it's like a three-digit possibly four-digit series IH with a looks like one two three four five bottom it's spinning pretty good there auto wheel slip and coming down farther we got quite the road coming Minneapolis Moline 670 diesel pulling a like four bottom a lot of wheel slip out here today this ground was previously turned Farmall 400 gas pulling an Oliver 4340 John Deere R. And they just keep coming, guys. We're going to go catch up with a couple caterpillars here. Well, I found the guys who aren't having traction problems today. That's John with his D6. That's an 8U. Six-cylinder D6. And then that is a 3J D2. Quite a few Ford tractors out here as well. Well, here's John's D6, taking a short break. It's quiet when it's just idling. Be a D318, I believe. Two cylinder pony. Very similar to what would be on a D2, D4, but bigger. No PTO on this tractor, no hydraulics. This one is an 8U 
2638SP. Undercarriage is beautiful. A lot of life in them. Grousers look good, sprockets look good. Top carriers show some wear. That's all right. Still plenty of life left in them. Especially since these are just toys now. Big front tow hook. It's got that nice canopy. Still original wood. I think someone added a steel top to it. Electric start pony, it's your battery box there. Undercarriage looks the same on this side. All track tin is in place. Very nice machine. Well, John's gonna let me take this out. So I'm gonna grab my co-pilot and we'll get you some video of us plowing with the D6. John Deere's, John Deere B, another John Deere B with a three bottom, Case 930, pulling a four bottom. The farther north we get, the stickier the ground is. We're really working for it here. Goes that John Deere 820. Looks like there's an M in the distance. Massey Ferguson there. Well, that's the only Alice I've seen out here today. It's a WD with a mounted, looks like a two bottom from here. I believe a W4, W6, looks like a W6 to me. The two bottom. I said the ground over on this side is even harder than what we just plowed. Close to the end of this field here, there's not a whole lot left. It looks like John found fourth gear in the D6. Really making it work. Well, they're just about wrapped up with this one. It's about four o'clock here. Started at noon, and they said this was an 80. So, about four hours to do an 80. But I gotta get heading back west. It's about a three and a half hour drive for me. So, appreciate everyone watching, and we'll catch you on the next one.